Hey guys, this is Tommy with So Easy Solutions, and today we're going to show you how to clone a funnel or a landing page. They get used interchangeably. We're going to call them funnels. They're landing pages, however you want to do it. Okay, so you've logged into uh, your So Easy Solutions, and we're going to go over to Sites on the left-hand side, and we're going to find the funnel that we want to duplicate. Juniper Street, let's duplicate this one. Click on our three dots here. We're going to go to clone. Perfect. Now, because I have access to other accounts, I will see more than uh, more accounts here with regard to locations. But we're going to call this new funnel. Spelling MST is always in effect. And we're going to click clone that funnel. Now, <clears throat> it may take a moment. Do a little re refresh here to see our new funnel will show up. Let's go and edit it. Now this clones everything about it, including the, um, the names of the pages. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of cleanup here. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go to settings and we're gonna give it a domain. We gotta click on our domain, perfect. New funnel, we'll do a spell check here. We're gonna change the path here. New funnel, perfect. We'll save that. It tells us some paths are going to be updated because it knows that this is duplicated and that you don't want to have overlapping paths. Okay. <clears throat> We're going to have to change our landing page name here. So let's call this new funnel. So that's going to be the we just updated the URL of this landing page. Now, what we have to do here is we're going to have to go and edit this page. There's a couple things you have to realize. It's using the exact same creative, so it's going to use the exact same form, and it's going to use the exact same uh, background. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over here, get out of the way here. We're going to go to background image, BG image. We'll click on it. It's going to take us to our media. Okay, there's a good one. Let's pull that one in. Let's, let's double click on that. Bam. Okay, our background image is, is changed. The thing we want to check now is we want to click on our button. We want to make sure our button says link to next step, not linked to a, a website, because next step makes it so it won't be static. It means it will, it, if you had linked to a website, it would go to the previously linked website and not our next step in our funnel. Okay, so we're good here. So let's click save over here. Hit save ing. Okay, bam. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to our opt-in area here. We're gonna change the landing page here, URL, new funnel that step perfect so now we're going to edit it two things we got to do we got to change the lead form and we're going to change the background image so let's change the background image let's go over here there's our background image boom background now let's go to our form we have our form here and we're going to put craigslist lead form we're going to put another form in here there we go now we hit save. Okay, let's go back and we'll click our URL here and we'll test it out. But we've do, we've just cloned this funnel and made this ready to rock and roll. And it's so easy, it really is. This whole thing is just, it's monumentally easy if you know what you're doing, of course, but it's easy. Click up here or you can copy and paste this, but we're gonna click, let's go back to our lead page, that's where we wanna go here. Let's click here. Okay, we know we got the, we know we got our new lead form because of the house, there we go, let's go next. Bam, there's the house, there's our new form, done. So easy. This is Tommy with So Easy Solutions. If you need more help, please let me know. I'll talk to you later, bye.